everyone welcome back to same right fashion academy youtube channel for another interesting tutorial so today's tutorial will be sewing uh, a kibis flayed dress so this kibis flayed dress i have the pattern already drafted so there's nothing much in uh, drafting kibis uh, dresses so what I have here is a flat pattern without that. If you look here, you can see there is no that. So simply draft your basic bodies for the kid and then you draft the basic back bodies, contour the back line and we are good to go. So I have my neckline here created, my asymmetric neckline created for this dress. So now I will be cutting my patterns right away. I'm going to cut my fabric, and my lining. We are going to have a half scale bodies pattern drafted, uh, sewn first. So after sewing a half scale bodies, I'll also be showing you how to attach this beautiful sleeve you are seeing right there on the thumb nail. Okay. So without wasting much time now, I'll jump into the cutting and I'll, add, I'll tell you how many seam allowances I, I, I added all around my patterns. So now I'm done cutting my patterns and here you can see I have my seam allowances added accordingly. On this side I added 1.5, I added 0.5 on the waistline. 0.5 on the armhole, shoulder seam line and neckline as you can see. This is the back pattern. I have four pieces of it, lining and fabric, one inch for zip, 1.5 on the side, 0.5 all around and 0.5 inch on the waist line. So now we are going to I put these patterns together. We are going to sew them together um, and you will see how this is going to be done. So I have to hair stay. I have my hair stay as you can see on fabric and on lining. So make sure you hair stay to give your, uh, your fabric structure. Okay, so now we'll be going into the sewing tutorial right away. So to sew this dress, I'm taking off my patterns. Like I said, it's a flat pattern. We don't actually uh, need a dart for this. So being a, a, a flat pattern, I'm taking off all I have right here on my, on my dress. So I'm going to sew lining to fabric, okay? So that is the pattern of sewing. And you'll be seeing why we are going to sew this way. So right side is facing right side. So I'll be sewing the neckline right side to right side. I'll be sewing the armhole like this, okay? We'll do the same for uh for the fabric for the back piece so i'll just match my necklines together accordingly Alright, so what we actually have here, the pattern we have here is a, um, the, is a sleeveless some. So, right, so now you can see I'm done securing my neckline. Okay, so I'll go over to the machine right now. I'm going to sew a 0 0.5 inch following the neckline and the armhole. Okay, I will sew and stop at about one and a half inch okay which is the seam allowance that we are going to use to shape in 
this dress okay all right so if you are new to this channel please kindly subscribe turn on your notification bell to receive videos like this every day like this video share to family and friends drop your comments on the comment section and your suggestions as well so i'm going to sew this now on my machine and i'll back to we'll be back to show you what it looks like then as for the back pattern I'm going to also repeat the same thing okay so I'll pick up one fabric pick up one lining match them face to face okay right side to right side so I'm going to sew the neckline I'm sewing my neckline right now so I'll just arrange them I'm sewing only on the neckline and on the arm hole okay to one inch for 1.5 for shaping I'll repeat the same thing the same process right here so I'll do all of that give it a good press and come back to show you what it looks like